Hey guys, hi, welcome back. Another episode with Smart Flips, and this time we have a guest. Yeah, he's here to help again. You know, whenever there's heavy stuff to lift, I have to call him. And uh, yeah, so we got to. Yeah, well, uh, in gratitude. <laughs> so yeah, we got. To, I got another storage unit, and um, this one was actually close to him, so that's why I called him. Ah, sorry. I called him so that uh, he can come check it out and help me uh, going through it. So, uh, all right, let's get to it. Okay. Okay. There you go. Let's me back off so we can see. Get a better picture on what's in here. All right. So, uh, what can I say? I mainly want the unit for that thing, Kitchen Island. And uh, this is just an added bonus. Yeah, it's not Jordan. Okay, it's locked. All right, we'll figure this out later. And all right, let's start moving things. Like yeah, I did feel like something maybe inside, but I don't trust it. Sometimes, because they, some of them they have just like a plastic mechanism inside. If it just falls off. All right, so I'm gonna try to pull out everything that may fall on us. There we go. Mm. Ah. I need that finger. <laughs> what is this? Uh, popcorn stand. Good start up. Yeah. Popcorn business. Oh, I think it's missing the top. That's the one I did see one corner here. Oh, I think it has also like a bed frame. Mm, like the chairs. See the tables? Yeah. We look so fine here. Yeah, it's a whole set. So let's try to because this is the main thing going home. I'm gonna try to take this one out. And then, and then I'm gonna remove these, the wicked chairs, the outdoor stuff. So that way I'll be able to take them home and straight to the backyard. Brown box. Anything interesting? Oh, you got it. Oh. Some baseball caps in there. Mm -hmm. In this city. Look nice. Oh, there is a bunch of them. There is a bunch of them. This one look, looks like Lacoste, but I think it's just the shape of it. Kansas Athletic Saints. Mm -hmm. Okay, you know what? They just put this stuff back inside. You see anything else? Mm. Oh, it doesn't have any. Billboard headphones. Okay. <clears throat> um, let's see what else. Uh, of course, there's another brown box right here. Looks like clothing. Let's see what kind of Grand Slam FJ. Oh, this is like golfing. Uh, this is a pole. Okay, small All right, so here's the next part of the goodies. Um, so you can see there are some vases. This one looks nice. I mean, I can see myself in this. Anyway, there are two sets, two different sets. Um, this cups, well, drinking cups, happy juice cups. Uh, they come with this decanter. It really looks nice, but it has. Uh, some blemish as you can see, the edge. Other than that, look at this cups. 
I mean, it's really good quality. Um, this dishes are um, Rachel Ray. Yeah, this is like a Rachel Ray. I believe this stuff usually sells coals. And then there is the uh, unicorn mugs. There's actually two of them. And yeah, I think this is some drinking cups or shots. Yeah, bright and boom. Yeah, this is yeah, this stuff I'm going to a thrift store. This stuff I'm going to list locally. See uh, if you have joined uh, the group uh, that I created at Facebook, most likely you will see the this stuff listed there. Otherwise, feel free to reach out if you're interested in any of this stuff, especially if you're local. There's also this uh, skillet. It's an 11 inch and a half, I think. Made in USA, and it's uh, the brand is Wear. So, um, yeah. This All right, guys. So now we go to the next part. The safe. You see the Jordan thing? Yeah, that is just a sticker. It's actually a century safe uh, lock. Um, safe i guess this one only use a key i didn't see any keys and uh the only thing left of the unit is uh uh is a uh, big furniture item so we gotta use some root force i was hoping there may be something here we could just like <clears throat> yeah i'm not that strong so using some pillows here and uh, here and cushions just for the noise because it is pretty late night and uh, well, I'm trying to not attract too much, don't to create too much noise. Alright, do you think there will be something here? This is not... My first safe, and uh, so far we did not have much luck. <clears throat> One thing I know for sure is Century Safe sucks. <laughs> All right, let's let's see. Can you see the well? Really the cheapest, crappiest safe. Alright, so this is birth certificate. Let's see. Um yeah, some personal paperwork. I think the camera is off, no? No, you can touch the back screen here. Alright. Uh, suit 300 milligram. That's some stuff to inject, I guess. So, this is alcohol wipes. I see some injections there. What is this? Drosta Nolone. Uh, do you know what that is? I think something for hmm? Something that is not gonna do me any good. Okay. Yeah, this is more uh, stuff for injections. And that's it. Hey guys, so here we are on the next day. Actually, the uh, stuff I found on the safe when I did the research, it, it turned out to be some uh, muscle enhancer that uh, bodybuilders use. So <laughs> yeah, that went to the trash, by the way. Also the safe <laughs> because it was useless. Anyway, I'm back at the unit. I've been I've been working out, I guess. I've been pulling out everything to check what I could actually sell, take some pictures and uh, now it's uh, loading time so I just want to show you what I have found so far 
what we got and uh, yeah so uh, yesterday I did show you the dryer there was no washer it's a Kenmore Elite uh, it looks okay I'm probably gonna list it for like a hundred bucks or something Facebook local see if it sells uh, these uh, the tables and the chairs uh, they um, they have uh, four chairs per table so there's two sets of them so it's pretty decent although some of them do show some rust I'm not sure if uh, previous owner had them uh, uh, had, had them used in a, like an outdoor setting or something and honestly I think they had like their own bar or own mini bar so let me just show you what this is so there is um, uh, seven chairs here uh, yeah there's seven one of them was missing the base but I did find it it was it just fell off I guess it just needs some screws so this table it's um, uh, well obvious I guess it's like a, a bar table thingy it does have the other piece I had to remove it just so I can install it um, it's a little bit loose the screws need to be tied up but uh, yeah it's uh, it's in used okay condition I guess and uh, here's the setting for uh, the couch uh, yeah this is the base part of the popcorn machine I showed you so um, yeah I need to clean the, the other one and then uh, put them together for a local sale I'm pretty sure I think they sell brand new for like 150 160 so I probably can get like 50 or 60 bucks for them so the couch it's a leather couch well not real leather um, it has seen some better days you can see there's a little bit of damage here and uh, here on the seating the base of this uh, this cushion so uh, I decided to actually list this all together um, this with the uh, coffee table yeah the coffee table looks a little fancy but you can see some scuffing here so it has some light damage same goes with the uh, bookshelf yeah everything seems to have been used and abused a little and also the chairs um, okay so the chairs I put them here inside so there is three of them they're okay but you can see there is some scuffing on the side so I took a picture of the whole thing so I would like a more like a, a whole sitting for a oh look there is a, a wrench attached here <laughs> all right this is interesting uh, yeah, I'm just gonna list uh, probably the three chair, the couch, the table, and the uh, the shelf. Maybe for 250, 250 or 200. Yeah, do you guys think it's a good price? I mean, definitely need some. Uh, the couch is not best shape, but definitely the rest of the chairs, they will probably make it worth it, especially for someone just starting out. Uh, yeah, the countertop here it actually looks like a uh, like a, a bar setup. You can see it has like a, uh, like the footrest for people sitting by by the ledge. I guess I'm not sure if it was used as. The, um, that's why like most of the stuff I noticed it looked like it's like a I don't know. It's too much for one person's bar, but you never know. So uh, yeah. Oh yeah, the stuff here. So there's one big folding table. Those are always good. The, this is a sliding door. Um, it's pretty huge. I think it's like 36 by 80. And uh, on the corner there, there is the, um, uh, the rail where it actually gets attached. So uh, yeah, that one I'm gonna list locally. The rest of the stuff I have here, these are all going to a thrift store. So there is a dresser, there is the um, bed frame and uh, with all the drawers and uh, yeah, it was it's mainly the bed frame. So the bed frame is actually one of those that have like a whole frame with uh, drawers in the bottom. The reason I'm not trying to sell this, it's because the some of the edges, I don't know if this was damaged, just didn't transport, but let's see. Yeah, there is like a scuffing on this edge, um, then some damage on the other. The dresser, the big dresser, I did find like a small damage here. Uh, yeah, that's like on the top part. And uh, yeah, stuff like that, it doesn't sell. 
this is the remain of the stuff going to the thrift store. So basically, all this stuff here in the corner, everything is going to the thrift store apart from the uh, folding uh, table and uh, the door. This, I'm going to try to, I'm going to list it 24 hour. If it doesn't get any interest, it's going to the thrift store. Either the thrift store or Habitat for Humanity. I know they get stuff like this. Um, honestly, I'm even tempted to just like take it apart, just keep the uh, top part of the shelf or try to sell the top part separate from the rest. But uh, we'll see. We'll see what we can do about that from now until tomorrow. Uh, what else? Yeah, so this is this is what the dresser, the big dresser should look like. So this is the nightstand that's come with. And uh, the, there are two mirrors. Hey. Yeah, so there is this huge mirror. This is like a, I think it's called like a body mirror. Pretty much where you can just like put it in the floor and stand next to it. You can see the whole thing. And uh, this one goes with the dresser. So I'm gonna try to sell this three piece together, three pieces together, uh, this whole set together. The, uh, uh, so this stuff I'm actually taking to um, um, my uh, storage unit. I have a storage unit where I, I can actually put this stuff in and uh, try to sell them because otherwise, yeah, there is rain coming later today. So uh, I don't have much time. And still the problem with Facebook, you list something and you have like the first 50 or 60 people contacting you or just spammers. So um, yeah, we'll have to find a different way to, to deal with this. And uh, typically with furniture, it, takes, it, it does take a couple days. So uh, yeah, all right. So this is what it comes down to. The, um, the other thing, the uh, kitchen island. The kitchen island, I took it home uh, and after some measurements, it turned out that it was too big for uh, the spot where we needed it. So uh, uh, we, I'll just have it listed on uh, Facebook Marketplace as well. So uh, yeah, I think uh, that's pretty much it. Yeah, this unit definitely did not, I don't know, I'm feeling weird about it because um, first of all, I paid up a little. Well, it's uh, $510. Plus fees. Overall, it's still a good deal. Uh, it just, uh, uh, I'm, I'm honestly was a little bit shocked to see so few items in this unit, and it, because it was, it was packed, but it was packed with just furniture. So uh, like uh, all the clothing, all the dishes. Well, not all the dishes. Most of the dishes, they went uh, to the thrift store. I already dropped them to the thrift store. So there was more donations uh, than actually stuff to keep for resale. But um, it's okay. It's still it's, it's still fine with me. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be um, it's gonna be still a good deal. Either way, thank you for guys for watching. I think this is the end of it. I'll let you know if the popcorn machine works. And um, yeah, I'm not, I don't think I'm gonna keep down. <laughs> But uh, otherwise, right, thank you guys for watching. I hope you are having a good day. You enjoyed uh, watching this video. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. And um, see you on the next one. In the meantime, take good care of yourself. All right, bye.